What's going on, Fabulous the Entertainer, Motivator, Educator, Lucky Murray, back with another Gamecock News update. Today, we're speaking about Shane Beamer really wanting that win against Kentucky. Uh, I actually did a video almost two months ago stating that we will beat the Kentucky Wildcats. I would have the video up here somewhere. But Shane Beamer, you could tell his voice really wanted this. Uh, this is a turning moment in the South Carolina football uh, in the Shane Beamer era, we may look back and say there was the catastal, uh that helped South Carolina get over the next hump. So we're gonna talk a little bit about that, um, and we're gonna go from there. I'm just gonna let Shane Beamer speak, and then we're gonna go from there. Um, but just so proud of our team. We told him it was gonna take all three phases, and it did. Um, special teams, defense, offense, and. Uh, you know, I'm sure y'all heard <laughs> that locker room in there. That's a uh, that's a joyous locker room, and just so happy for our players and our fans. Uh, um, it's a great night for uh, all Gamecocks, and um, you know, it, it. I just told the team in there it wasn't lost on me that uh, two years ago when South Carolina came up here, and there's a bunch of players on this team that were there that or here that night um, it's not lost on me that uh, that was a certainly a low point for the players in this program uh, their coach had been fired they came up here and got beat handedly and literally during the game I'm sitting there watching it on television back in Norman Oklahoma um, sorry <laughs> um, watching it on TV in Norman Oklahoma and during the game is when Coach Tanner and, and Chance uh, reached out. To, I'll never forget Coach Tanner calling me and saying, you ready to do this? And I told him, I've been waiting my whole life for you to say that. And um, the players came in that night and walked back in this same locker room and picked up their phones and saw the news. And probably other than Jaheim, I knew in high school because I recruited him. DK, I knew because I recruited him. Everybody else probably said, who in the heck is Shane Beamer? And he's our new head coach. Um, and for those guys to go from that point where they were two, less than two years ago to this night up here is, is pretty, pretty special. And we were shorthanded as well. I know they had injuries. I want to stop right there and kind of uh, keep going on that sense uh, because of the simple fact that I want you guys to really understand, like, this was a huge win for the Gamecocks. And I think – you have some people on Twitter saying, well, we were supposed to beat Kentucky. It's not a guarantee. Even though Kentucky was losing their quarterback, even though Kentucky had some injuries, we have injuries as well. I believe that the first half, it really showed that Kentucky was still in this game. And me live streaming it last night, I was like, yo, this this may be it. We, we may lose this game. But ultimately, we... Ultimately, ultimately, we did win the game, and ultimately, we're sitting at four and two, with the chance to go to Texas A and M and get another win. Texas A and M clearly is not the team that everybody thought it was going to be, but they're still a good team, and that's another level of expectation that needs to happen uh is is carolina favored in that game i don't think so but i do know that playing for a coach like shay beamer you have to get behind and some people may not like that some people may not understand that but i i love it i love it man i love it but here's what i need you to do let me know what you think about that in the comment section below again it's the entertainer motivator educator and please don't forget all three Lucky Murray back with another uh, Game Card News update today, man. Shane Beamer wants it. Is super excited about the win against Kentucky. Uh, man, we're here for it, man. We're here for the win and to play against um, Texas A&M. Y'all let me know what y'all think about that in the comment section below. But like always, it's the next time, people.